Today I want to talk about every time you say yes to something, you're saying no to making money and to doing your own business. So it's Motivational Monday and I've been thinking about this and I've been thinking a lot about this and every time you say yes to doing something or yes to doing something for someone, you're saying no. You're saying no to working on doing some listings. So example, just easy example today. I sit there and watch YouTube live and there's nothing wrong with everyone doing all these YouTube lives. But if I sit there and I'm in the chat for the whole hour and a half that this person is live, I'm not getting any of my work done. I'm not getting any of my listings done. It's not rude if I don't go on the chat. I can go on the chat at the start and I'm still watching. I've got it on the background. You're like a podcast for me. I'm still watching you. But every time I say yes to just sitting there and just fucking socially talking, I am not listing. I am not listing. So I am saying no. I am now saying no to making money for myself. Now don't get me wrong, it's good to sit down and uh, have a good chat with all your new buddies and all that on the internet and all that, but because there is so many lives and all that, I would not be offended if someone said, hey, I'm just happy on the background while I'm listening and taking photos, there's not a problem with that. So there's no problem with that. So remember, every time you say yes to YouTube, uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, you're saying no to uh, focusing on making money and listing and doing your work. Now, like I said, once again, there's nothing wrong with uh, sitting down and watching the YouTube videos and doing your Twitter and your Facebook and all that if it's what you want to do. But what I'm saying is make time for it. Make time for that. Do it when you're on the train to work. Do it when you're on the train on the way home from work, on your lunch breaks from work, because you can't do all these other things for your business while you're at work. When you're at home, that's when you need to focus and do those things. Now, no shit, when I'm at work, these are just some of the notebooks. These are just some of the notebooks that I write in, and I write in notebooks all the time. I'm always planning, I'm always planning, always planning. And the reason I'm always planning is I'm always writing ideas down and 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 ideas down. And ideas down. Get yourself scrapbooks and write your ideas down. It helps so much, it helps so much. But really, take a, take a long think about this. Take a long think about this because this is what today's Motivational Monday is about. You're probably wasting your time from listening right now from just listening to this. But maybe this is helping you as well really thought hard about it and every time you say yes to something you're saying no to something else just remember so if I say yes to a bunch of friends want to do a whole day a whole day of drinking but I only want to do a couple of hours but I say yes to it and I do the whole day of drinking well in my books I've written here that I need to do this and I need to do that and I haven't crossed them out yet because I haven't done them. Well, why am I saying yes to going out and drinking and saying no to being successful and grabbing all that money that I should be earning and listing and going and sourcing and all that? I can do all the fun things and say yes to the fun things once I have completed my things that I'm going to say no to because then I'm saying no to nothing. So get all your work done first before you go out and uh, uh, do these uh, little things, okay? Okay, so we talked about last week, uh, we talked about, we talked about our motivational board. Now I'm covering something up here because I don't want people to see it just in case I get in trouble. So I've entered this competition to be on a game show. And that's what that is. So every day I see that and it motivates me that I'm gonna get through. I'm thinking about in my head that I'm gonna win that prize money. I am going to be at the end, I'm going to be on that show. Uh, I can't tell you what that show is yet unless I, until I get, once I get through, that's what I'm gonna say, once I get through. Um, I've already got through the second round. 
second stage, sending uh, my next lot of videos to them. Entries are closed now, by the way. Uh, so I'm down to the second round, and I had it on my motivational board, I was just fucking, the, the first day I did it, and I put it on there, and I'm staring at it, and I sent the video, and one of the questions was, why do you want to win the competition? Uh, in the video response that I sent to them, and maybe this is why I got through to the second round, I said, um, I don't want to win your competition, I am going to win your competition. I will win your competition, it's going to happen, I will see you on TV, give me a call, goodbye, bang. And I turned the video camera off, I sent that video. <laughs> Next day, from the executive producer, I got an email because I was just staring and staring and staring at this thing on my pin board. Motivational, I was bringing it to me, I was bringing it to me. And round two, which round two, I'm gonna uh, make my next lot of videos, I gotta put all my detail, uh, all different uh, details in and all that. They want my passport for some reason, I don't know why. Um, and, um, I am going to enter the round two stage and then hopefully for round three, not hopefully, I will. I will get called in for a face-to-face uh, -face interview. That's what we're uh, planning for. That's what I keep looking for. So what did you put on your motivational board this week? Let me know down in the comments. What did you put down in your motivational board after last week's episode when I told you? And um, did it work? Did anything work from your motivational board? I'm gonna read one little bit from The Secret and then we're done for Motivational Monday this week. Um, and this is powerful because, uh, this is really powerful because it's a powerful process of visualization which I told you about uh, last week about putting something on your board and that's what I did and look how fast that happened. Um, I can't tell you, it's up to them if I get through this uh, show and I can't tell you what the show is uh, because it says on the Thing I'm not allowed to say. Um, not that it's a really big deal, but it is a big deal. So if I can get on, that would be fucking cool. All right. So this is, and this worked, and this worked. Okay. So this is the powerful process of visualization. Visualization. <laughs> the reason visualization is so powerful is because as you create pictures in your mind of seeing yourself with what you want, you are generating thoughts and feelings of having it now. And that's what I did every night. I've been visualizing and visualizing what is on my board there, that I am on that show. I'm visualizing it, I'm visualizing it. Visualizing the sales, I'm visualizing the sales, I'm visualizing something getting sold. Visualizing my house getting built, I'm visualizing going to Disneyland, whatever you want. Visualize it and you'll focus on uh, making that happen. Visualization is simply powerful, focused thoughts in pictures, and it causes equally powerful feelings. When you are visualizing, you are pulling in that powerful frequency out into the universe. The law of attraction will take hold of that powerful signal and return those pictures back to you just like you saw them in your mind. I've seen it all in my mind, I've seen so many different things in my mind, but unless you put it on the board and you look at it every day, you're not going to think about it. So please, give me a thumbs up, give me a subscribe um, and hit that bell icon every Monday. Uh, let me know if uh, next week you want me to do another one of these. Or maybe do you want me to do a live motivational Monday uh, Monday night and maybe get someone on and we hear some uh, motivational stories from other resellers? Um, you let me know. But uh, I might do that. Anyway, guys, um, remember, every time you say yes, you're saying no to something else. And that's what you need to focus on this week. Every time you say yes, you're saying no. You're saying yes to going to have that beer you're saying no to making money, okay? And visualization board, that's what we wanna work on this week. Thanks guys, thumbs up, subscribe, like, share, let's do it all again.